Hi, I'm Eric with Home Network Central, and I'm going to show you how to reset your Amped Wireless router to default factory settings. Basically, this is going to reset everything on this router to factory default just like you got it from the store. So if you can't remember a password, like you can't remember your login password, or you can't remember your Wi-Fi password, or if you have some kind of settings on here that are messing you up, uh, this process is going to reset everything just like it was brand new from the store. So you can start over fresh. So what we're gonna do is, first thing we're gonna do is power it on. So I'm gonna plug it in. It needs to be on, it needs to be powered up. So you plug this in here. And we're looking at the front here. So you see that LED? All of these lights are gonna, well not all of them, but they're eventually gonna start coming on like when the Wi-Fi is enabled and because it's booting up right now. So more lights are gonna come on. But we're concerned with the power light. And basically when that light, we're gonna press a button on here. And when that light starts flashing, that means we can let go of the button and see the, the lights are coming on. So what we're gonna do is, you go to the back of the router and you're looking for a little hole. See, there's a hole here that says reset and there's a button deep down inside there. They make it hard to press so you can't do it by mistake. So you can't really use your finger to do this. So you gotta get something sharp, like, well maybe not sharp, but you got like a fork or a pen or a pencil or a safety pin. I'm gonna use a fork because I can, I can get this plastic fork and I can bend it so I can stick it in that hole down there. So we're gonna stick something in there and we're gonna hold, you don't just wanna press it once, you wanna hold the button down for at least 10 seconds. And what's gonna happen to know for sure, like you don't really need the lights to do this, but this is just so you know that you can be comfortable that, the, that it's resetting. We're gonna watch this uh, power LED to make sure that it starts blinking. So I'm gonna prep my camera up here. I got, I have a low camera budget, so I don't have anything fancy. I just got to lean up my camera against something. So watch that LED. Again, your router might be a different model. It might be different, but just I just want to show you how you can tell that it's resetting. We're going to go ahead and I'm going to press this button. with. I'm going to press the fork inside that hole. So here we go. I'm pressing it starting right. I'm going to press it and hold it starting now, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. See, now it's flashing, so that means I can let go of the button. And you'll notice the router in just any second now will start to reboot. There it goes. So now it's rebooting, and when it comes back on, it'll have all the factory default settings just like it was brand new out of the box. So no any settings or passwords that you had on there will be reset to how it was when you bought it new from the store. If that helped you out, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching.